Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and I wonder if you are still celebrating the Jubilee Year of Mercy. So often we have a special time like this, and we are all excited when it starts, but then after a while the novelty wears off and we tend to forget that we still have a couple more months to go in this time of extraordinary grace for the church and the world. In an interview book called The Name of God is Mercy, Pope Francis said that sin is more than a stain for which one goes to confession, like going to the dry cleaners. Sin is a wound that needs treatment and healing, something much deeper than applying a stain remover. And after we begin the process of healing, we need medicine to continue the healing. What medicine does Pope Francis recommend? A few years ago, he said this, Now, I would like to recommend a medicine to you. Some of you may be wondering, is the Pope a pharmacist now? It is a spiritual medicine in a little box containing 59 beads on a string. This little box contains the medicine and will be distributed to you by volunteers as you leave the square. Take them. There is a rosary with which you can pray the chaplet of divine mercy, spiritual help for our souls and for spreading love, forgiveness, and brotherhood everywhere. Do not forget to take it because it is good for you. It is good for the heart, the soul, and for life in general. So, are you taking your medicine every day? That rosary can be used in the traditional way, especially during this month dedicated to the Most Holy Rosary, but it can also be used to pray for God's mercy to pour out upon the world as we pray for the sake of his sorrowful passion have mercy on us and on the whole world.